So, this is the new season. Ooh, I've been living under a rock. Then let me just free your mind so you know what's happened. For those of you who can't play the game or stopped a long time ago, here you go. This is some footage. I'm going to be talking about uh, lots of things that are in the game. Uh, I'm not doing any of those clickbait free rewards like Baby Yoda's unlockable skin. No, no. I'm just talking about the game. There's a lot of new locations like um, Colossal Coliseum, Coliseum, Salty Towers, Stealthy Stronghold, and Hunter's Haven. There's a lot of unnamed locations too. Like you got the Jer Burger, the Tomato Town, uh, you got Man Cakes, little thing. So let me talk about this. So, in lots of these locations, you got these NPCs, which can give you rewards for killing other players or doing stuff in general. There's m many, and I mean many, NPCs that can give you lots of things. But the most, the NPCs that have skins in the battle pass, well, those are the ones that are pretty important too. So first there is Mancake, which is a literal pancake. <sighs> Season eight, all over again, peely. But anyway, these guys can give you new rarity weapons, uh, exotics. About the exotics, there are many. There's a heavy sniper, there's a a suppressed pistol, there is many different things too. I literally go on about how these are, but I wouldn't want to bore you. So anyway, we're going to, if you want to listen to me, you don't have to mute me. But if you want to hear me ramble on, or you don't, you can just mute me. See that right there? That's a speech bubble, and that's an NPC. So, what the NPC's job is to do is sell the player weapons. You can duel them for weapons, too. Uh, you can also upgrade weapons. There's a lot of things you can do with these NPCs. And... People are wondering about the mythics in the game. There's only two in the game so far. I don't know if they're going to add more. But there's a... He, both Mandalorian ones. So you got this guy. Who will give you 100 wood for... That. So what you can do is... Harvest building materials. See, this is a quest. Yeah. He just wants you to collect building materials. And he will give you gold or XP and stuff like that. Maybe ammo, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what he gives. I haven't done his quest ever. But another thing that there is to note is that the Mandalorian stuff is a sniper and a jetpack. The jetpack has unlimited use, but can only fly for a certain amount of time. The Mandalorian Sniper has heat vision and can be dealt for a lot of damage, I guess. It's not that much. I mean, it's a lot. Also, it does melee if you do not hold the uh, aim. And yeah. Another thing is that they did unbolt a lot of weapons like this. The submachine gun. They uh, also unbolted the AK-47 and lots of different weapons that people like. They did, however, bolt the uh, pump shotgun, which is getting a lot of hate on Epic Games, which I can't blame them. The pump is really good, but they also added new guns as well. Like they've added the um a lever action and a dragon shotgun. The dragon shotgun shoots um fire. It has one shot and it does a okay.
okay amount. And then the thing is that you can drive cars. Here's a lever action. It has eight shots and is kind of trash. Just kinda. Okay, so maybe. There also is this thing called gold bars, which is the new currency. It's a currency that you can use in games and other things like that. Yes, see the AK? They also brought back the, um, the, uh, heavy assault rifle. Like the purple and legendary. I, yeah. Um, they also brought back the pew pew rifle. Not meowsles, but like just the pew pew rifle. I'm not sure what it's called, but like, it's there. Another thing is, th is that you can kill the NPCs, but they, it's not like they hold that good of loot. See, those are some NPCs as well. These ones will spawn anywhere on the map and are pretty awful. Okay, 400 health. I don't know why. You can't shake them down, like so. Yeah, that's the rifle I'm talking about. The PPU rifle. I'm gonna see what it's called. Also, if you want to know this beautiful skin I got, it's from my friend. As he put it, he has his own channel. I've played with him before. He's a great friend, and yeah, you want to go check his channel out? It's hooded, and yes, this is yeah the tactical assault rifle. Yeah, it's a pew pew. It goes pew 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 pew. But those guys are annoying because they can spawn anywhere in this right here. See one of these? You better get ready for a fight. These guys have 400 health. They drop shields. Pew pew rifles, gold, and ammo. Another thing is, is that the sand here can be a little annoying at some times. But another thing that you want to know about the sand is that you can go into it. Um, yeah, you just have to stand still. It used to have been when you drank shields or stuff like that, but they fixed that. Uh, it does do that for emotes, like with Mystique's emote, you, it takes too long and you will be spat on the ground. You can move in this, it's a good source of transportation, and yeah. But you can be shot in this, so be careful. Another thing is that there have been collabs this season. Last season I know they did a collab with Marble, which was the big theme. Another thing was, is that you could say there was a collab with Rocket League, but yeah. Something else that has happened in this is that there is new collabs, and let me just show you something. This is the uh, new NPC. Yes, he's named Mancake. He can sell you this exotic pistol. It is pretty cool. It's a scope one. Another thing is that you could always you could always say that there is two things, but there is the that orb that you probably saw earlier, but that hasn't been really important to the story yet. Galactus, if you didn't see the live event, I tried to record it, but anyway, Galactus took it and was eating it up, and then Tony Stark saved him. Well, Oz. Anyway, yes, yeah, so that's the season so far. Don't know if they're adding any more weapons or anything. I am trying to, like, find weapons that you can get. I haven't gotten any exotics. Some of them are hard. But, um, I'm just gonna show you the battle pass real quick. 
I went to another match. So anyway, yeah. The battle pass is pretty good. It's okay. I'm not saying it's bad, but it's okay. And maybe t today I'll probably do a match with my brother. I don't know if I have that much time. But I will probably. Yes. You have a little brother. So this is the battle pass so far. I haven't gotten that far. The first skin you get is the Mandalorian. That he did do a collab with Star Wars. I just forgot that. They've done a lot. Man cake. You got lots of V Bucks. You can do this with Man Cake. It's like a little thing. Gun thing with syrup. It just, it just pours on his head. Yeah, the max tier is going to be Baby Yoda and another version of the Mandalorian. But yeah, that's it for now. So, goodbye.